one of my other big loves going back to childhood is I, I raced BMX from the time I was a young kid up through high school and then you know, didn't do it for many years as I was going to school and when I became a professional. Uh, but now in my 40s, I've actually come back and have been racing BMX for the last couple of years. Uh, and it's super fun. Uh, it's, it hurts to crash uh, more than when we were younger. Um, but, you know, uh, coming out of the gate or, or you know, hitting a jump is, is still as fun as it was as a kid. I'm Dustin Sharp. I'm an associate professor at the Croc School of Peace Studies at the University of San Diego. I guess my first extensive experience teaching was in the Peace Corps. Uh, so I was an English teacher uh, from 1996 to 1998 in Guinea in West Africa. And that experience with the, the students was just very powerful and positive. And not just the, the classroom experience, which had its ups and downs, um, but maintaining those relationships and, and being able to go back 20 years later and see some of my students who are now working for government and NGOs uh, has been super rewarding. Um, well, the world has gotten a lot better. Uh, people don't believe it, uh, but we live in the most peaceful, most prosperous, uh, most rights respecting time in, in human history and that's actually not an accident. Um, it's because of the efforts of advocates, reformers, um, scientists, um, and, and people actually willing to sort of uh, put their nose to the grindstone and, and fight for a better world. So I think that um, we can't take that progress for granted as we've seen for the last couple of years. I mean there's been some setbacks. Right? Um, peace is not an accomplishment. You don't arrive at it and then just get to sort of settle down and not think about it anymore. It's, it's a constant struggle. Um, I do think the arc of history bends towards justice, um, but that's only because of the, the, the you know, blood, sweat, and tears of human rights advocates and uh, peace advocates, poverty advocates uh, that have come before us.